Hi, I'm Dr. Ryan Hill in Cincinnati, Ohio. And in this video, I'm going to go through the hearing test that you take on the new Apple AirPods Pro. As you can see, I have them in my ears, right and left. This is my right, that's my left. Um, and I have my case here. I've already paired these to my phone, but I'm gonna go ahead and start recording my phone and then I'll pull it up here on the screen next to me um, as soon as I get that set up. And then um, what we'll do is we'll get into the settings. Um, and mine are called Dr. Hill's AirPods Pro. And I'm gonna go down to take a hearing test. So what we do is click the button and hit get started. I'm 18 or older. Uh, I'm not, cons not currently experiencing allergies or anything in sinuses. And I haven't been on a construction site in the last 24 hours. So this is just assessing and looking at the noise level and I actually just had some um, dulling of the sound in my ears and you can see too much noise because I'm talking. So I'll, I'll stop talking for a second. Just going to adjust. Make sure they're pushed in. Start to check. Well, that was a cool little tone to check the fit and the noise around. Uh, next, it's going to tell us that the fit is good. It's going to put it on do not disturb so we're not disturbed. And then it's going to play tones at different volumes and frequencies, just like an audiogram. And we're going to press the screen in the circle to signify that we uh, heard the tone. Heard the tone. Tap the button. Same thing. All right. So now we're just going to fast forward through the rest of my left ear here while it collects all the data from every button push that I have. So that was pretty easy. Let's go to the right. And we'll do another fast forward here while I collect the data on the right ear. All right, so that test is complete. Um, let's go ahead and look at what the results say. Little to no loss in both ears. So. That was expected. I have normal hearing, so it's not going to give me any hearing assistance because I don't need it. <clears throat> the hearing test itself is uh, pretty straightforward. You're just listening for some tones. It's really similar to the pure tone audiogram we give patients. Um, it's really just assessing the um, sensitivity at different frequencies in each ear. Um, and, you know, we do that on a dB scale or decibel scale and it's about sound pressure in the ear. So this is determined that normal sound pressure is uh, needed in my ear. Um, and you know, that's consistent. I don't, it didn't give me a map or an audiogram here, um, but there, there are many more parts to a hearing test. There's, um, you know, word recognition scores so we can assess processing and the ability to discriminate certain words from others. Um, and then we also do speech and noise testing. There's bone conduction. So this is air conduction. This air conduction test goes through um, your outer ear, your middle ear, and your inner ear. So we're assessing the whole ear um, and all of its systems together because that's how you hear from the outside and that's how the Apple hearing aid can help. Um, but when we actually do a full audiogram or a full hearing test, uh, we look at the different components separately and we have different tests for that. We actually do pure tones with a bone conductor behind the ear to bypass the outer and middle ear to see if there's any conductive components. We test for middle ear function with the test called a tympanogram. So, you know, these AirPods, although they might help certain patients, um, you know, could cause certain patients to miss different conditions such as a conductive hearing loss, problems with the bones, fluid behind the ear. Um, you know, if there's an asymmetry in hearing, meaning one ear is much different than the other, uh, that can be due to neurological changes, it can be due to genetics, 
Uh, but a big thing that we help to rule out are acoustic neuromas or vestibular schwannomas, which are tumors of the inner ear. So uh, I'm just a little afraid these things are going to miss, you know, cause some patients to miss certain conditions. It could be medically treated. Um, but I'll follow up here with another video um, on a few different things to see how well uh, these guys actually work. If you like our videos and would like to keep seeing more new content, please like and subscribe to our page by clicking the thumbs up button and the subscribe button. You can also hit the alert button to notify you when we upload more new content.